Hey guys, Kevin here from Pwn Zone Gaming. Today I'm going to be showing you how you can update your local Minecraft server with the new version of Minecraft. So if we take a look at our server that we're running right now, that I showed you how to create in a different video, um, we're running currently 1.2.5. Now this is not the current version of Minecraft, a new version just came out, 1.3.1. So we need to upgrade our server to reflect that. Now, if you're watching this and this video is um, obviously going to be irrelevant at some point because um, the upgrades will co keep coming out on Minecraft, so it probably will be further on than 1.3.1, don't worry because the technique is the same um, regardless of the version. So this still will help you even if these versions aren't the same that I'm showing you right now. So what I'm going to do is open up Minecraft and you can see the reason that we need to actually update this. If I go to multiplayer, this top survival uh, tutorial server is the one that we are running right now. And I click join server, and it's going to take and fail, connection lost, end of stream. Now, I am running Minecraft 1.3.1, and the server is at 1.2.5, so there's a conflict there. So we just need to update these server files. So I'm just going to take and close that out. Go over to Firefox. We need to come to Minecraft.net. We need to go to Play Minecraft and click on Download. Now what we need to get is this minecraft underscore server dot exe. So I'm going to save that out into my downloads. Okay, so I have that in the downloads. I can minimize that. Create a new folder on your desktop. You want to be very specific in the naming of this folder because you don't want to get confused when you're copying things from your old server to your new um, server. Otherwise, you might accidentally overwrite something. So it's very um, important to keep this named accordingly. So I'm going to say minecraft 1.3.1. So well, 1.3.1. Okay, so now we shouldn't have any issues there. And so what I'm going to do is take and open up this folder. And then I'm going to take and drag in this Minecraft server exe that we just downloaded. And I can close that. So then I'm just going to take and run that file. It's going to create all of our files. Now if you followed along with that other video showing you how to set up the server in the first place, this is all going to make sense to you. So I'm just going to take and close that once I hit this done right here in this little command prompt chat. Takes a second to close. And basically now we have 1.3.1 run, running on its own server. Now this presents a few problems to us. One, we have our server right here, which is I think 1.5 or 1.2.5. So um, what the issue is is that we have a brand new world over here. Okay, and we need to take our old world where we have all of our progress and get it over here. So basically we're just going to take and delete the world out of 1.3.1 and we're going to take and just copy our world from over here and paste it into our 1.3.1 uh, folder. So then I can take these band IPs, band players, ops, maybe server. Um, I'd leave this other server file alone, but for the most part these should be okay. So then we'll copy those, paste those over. It's going to ask if you want to replace those and you want to take and copy and replace. Yes. Okay. So now we have our old world folder from our Minecraft 1.2.5 into our 1.3.1 folder. So now we should be able to take and start this server up. So I'm just going to run that. Okay. It's ready to go. And look at this. It says starting Minecraft server version 1.3.1 in survival. All this is accurate to what we have um, from our old server. So this is good. So we'll turn on Minecraft, go to multiplayer. Here's our server, join server and logging in. Perfect. We've now upgraded our local server to 1.3.1, a new version of Minecraft. So again, don't worry if um, for whatever reason, this is um, outdated. Basically, um, the technique is the same. You should be able to update regardless of the versions that I'm using in this video. So thanks for watching. I hope you guys learned something. I hope you can take and update your server. Um, make sure and check back soon because I'll be having more gameplay videos and tutorials for you guys. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.